Court will therefore impose the following sentence. Uh, for count one, vehicular homicide as to Aaron Godinez, the court will impose a sentence to two years in the Department of Corrections. The driver convicted in a crash that killed five people has been sentenced to more than a decade in prison. Jesus Puebla was driving a truck on I-25 in Weld County in June of 2022 when he slammed into the back of a car that stopped for traffic. The jury found him guilty of vehicular homicide and today sentenced by a judge to 11 years. Nine News investigative reporter Kevin Vaughn has been covering the case. He was in court today. Kevin, as you might imagine, it was an emotional day. Tom, there were a lot of tears. It was a difficult day, both for the family members of the people who died in this crash and for the driver of the truck that caused it. All of them gave emotional testimony. This all stems from a crash two years ago on I-25 in Weld County. Jesus Pueblo was driving a truck that crashed into a vehicle carrying three generations of the same family. It took the lives of Emiliano and Cristina Godinez, their son Aaron and his fiance Haley Everts, and the young couple's infant daughter, Tesley. We've got some sound from the daughter, sister, and aunt of one of those victims, and from Puebla himself. I would like to say that I am so sorry that this happened, and I never meant to hurt anyone. I won't get, I won't get my daddy to walk me down the aisle. I won't get my mommy to hold my hand when I'm giving birth. I will have my brother and his wife be at my wedding or be an aunt and uncle to my children. Pueblo was eligible for probation, but the judge said that that would diminish the value of the lives lost and that it was important that he serve a prison sentence. He actually is likely to serve less than the 11 years. He can take time off of that with his behavior and other factors. In Greeley, Kevin Vaughn, Nine News.